Cassie and Cameron back to the channel with another one. I hope you guys had a second to check out the vlog that we just did at the Drake It's All a Blur tour. Fire, fire. I had a great night. It was down at the Miami Heat Stadium. If you guys want to see 21's performance by himself, go check out the second channel, the All Seeing Concerts. We uploaded that there. Fire performance. If you a 21 Savage fan, you know you don't want to miss that. We got more of the concert coming to here, coming to this channel as well. We're gonna upload one of these days. I'm not exactly sure what day yet, but I promise you, I'm thinking Friday with all my dogs. They might just drop together. Just you know, the album comes out, new Drake. We might do a Drake Day Friday. Actually, this is probably Friday. I'm thinking about dropping this shirt Friday because October 6th, we have a new Drake album for all my dogs. You can't even say for all my dogs. We gotta add the Canadian accent in there. If you don't know, go watch Say It by Tory Lanez at the beginning of the video. You see how he turns it on and turns it off. But you gotta say for all my dogs. It's for all my dogs. So all my dogs comes out this Friday, October 6th. We got a, we got a sack of merch. Literally. A sack of merch. <laughs> They had no bags at the concerts, no bags at all. So, shout out to homie whoever was in line and was like, yo, bro, you know there's always some random dudes that want to talk to you, but today he was valuable. He came up, he was like, yo, just to let you know there's no, I heard you over talking to your girl saying you want to buy a couple shirts and you want to buy more than one. I would suggest you grab one of the umbrella bags, that's what I'm doing, because there's no bags. I was like, yo, shout, shout outs to you. Like, usually I'd be like, yo, I don't really... Fuck on my face, I don't really want to talk to you, bruh. I don't really want the conversation, nigga. I'm here with mine. Ready to have a good time. But today I had time and look, 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 look. It benefited me because he got me still rocking out here with an umbrella bag. This is for umbrellas. But let's start going through this unboxing. Shout out to Drake, bro. An amazing show. All jokes aside, concert was fire. Production was fire. Seeing Peter Pan flying through, even though I seen conspiracies online with the bed coming in and out of the floor, the couch when he was rapping to his younger self. Lord knows. He even went into dog demo. I love. I also really enjoyed the songs he performed. I feel like he went all over the place and I was happy. I was actually happy with that. I was praying for another last song. I forgot exactly what last song he did, but all I'm saying, I want to congratulations. If you guys remember Young Drake, congratulations. That shit used to always hit me different or fear. That's what I was hoping for. He's like, I'm gonna do, I was like, yo, let me get fit, closer to my dreams. Oh my God, I would have passed out. <laughs> they would have to grab me at the show. They would have to grab me at the show. Somebody would have had to grab me at the show. But with no further ado, let's start going through this. We're going to break this up into a couple parts because we have a couple shows and I just don't feel like doing one long ass video. Got to want to take a quick, little quick session break real quick, you know, a little quick break. So we're going to break these up, but God damn. I packed the shit out of that. Man. Is this the right shirt that we're doing first? Yes, it is. Out of all odds. This is the one that comes up first. Let's discuss. I don't need that use. I need that use condom no more. Shout out to October's very own. You guys know my birthday is also in October, so I always felt different every time you Drake used to your OVO before it was even a clothing brand. I'm just letting you know. Shout out to October 6th. Drake gave us a new album. Hopefully. Uh, hopefully future me on October 6th is listening to that shit right now wearing the shirt future me is wearing this shirt Listening to the new Drake future me is doing that. That's what I pray for I hope future me is not like what is this bullshit for all my dogs merch tea Also a little insider is he had for all my dogs merch at the show that I just went to I just went to Miami first day Thursday last th only three more shows after that uh, he was not selling for all my dogs merch in the first half of the tour because I have friends that went to Boston I have friends that went to New York both of them told me one this shirt wasn't available There was a bra t-shirt as well lost and found I heard that wasn't available There was a couple different shirts, but then the Peter Pan shirt that they had available to buy up there It sold out in the lane and I wanted I wanted that to be one of the shirts that we grabbed That was supposed to be one of the shirts that we grabbed when I was like, yo, homie, you guys are missing a shirt. Look. He was like, yeah, bro, that shit just sold out show, show before in LA. And I'm like, I bet it would. I bet it would. But in the front, what we see here is for all my dogs. If you guys recall, this came, this album cover came from his son Adonis drawing it. So that's the picture we see right here on the merch, the album cover. And on the back, the graphic continues. You see for all my dogs. And then with that, there's a scribble in the bottom. But the scribble low key, I was thinking, was it like Adonis supposed to be like an interpretation of him scribbling on a paper or something? 
or is it supposed to be a dog? Because I feel like it's a cloud. You know when people be looking at clouds and they be like, yo, what do you see? You see a middle finger, some other niggas see a sneaker. You're like, well, hold on, whoa, whoa, whoa. We, that's two different parts of the body. Like, how, how you saw a foot and I saw a finger? Like, this is crazy. Is this one of those? Because I see a dog low key. Like a dog, ears, I don't know how good y'all can see it, but you know the zoom up, I'll do it better for you guys. But the dog ears right there with the brown, the muzzle and orange. I don't know if I'm tripping. You guys let me know. But what do you guys think? What do you guys think about the merch? Are you guys fans of the album? That's really what I want to know because you guys are in the future right now watching this shit. The album came out today. Hopefully, because Drake been capping. Hopefully, the album came out today. Hopefully. But he even talked about it during the tour. Don't do me like that, bro. Don't do me like that. Hopefully, the album came out today. If so, how do you guys feel about it? Also, how do you feel about the merch? Are you guys a fan of Drake that much that you're gonna go get some album merch? I personally am a fan. Would I have went out of my way? I don't know, I haven't heard the album yet. But, but, if I'm in live in concert, you know we're grabbing, we're grabbing merch for sure. And then a person like 21 and Drake, we gotta leave with something. We gotta leave with something. We left with a lot of something. But this was the first shirt that we grabbed. And in the back of it as well, I forgot to point that out. The font for the for all my dogs, I'm not sure how good you can see it, but it looks like it was written with like a crayon. For all my people that be into conspiracy theories, I have seen some scary stuff about the album cover. I have seen some scary stuff about it, I'm not gonna lie to you. Red eyes, is this supposed to really be a dog? Like the Armageddon, the three different horses. Remember when we reacted to the Bad Bunny and I was telling you guys? I'm like, no, nah, the conspiracy theory, me, the one that be burning and just watching random videos that you kind of don't all believe, but you kind of like watching it for entertainment. They talk about this, they talk about this, Drake slapped this on our shirt with the red eyes and all. Again, I'm just joking with you guys. I do just believe that conspiracy theories keep that fan of entertainment. Drake looked at it and might have liked it. I was like, you know what? Let's put this as the album cover. God only knows. You guys know in this channel, I try to avoid all that demonic stuff and all that crazy upside down crosses, any sixes or anything like that. I try to avoid it. And it was any 666 merch at his shit, I would have definitely avoided it. That's not things that I do. But I'm like, come on, bro. Don't, don't, do, don't even bring that conspiracy theory shit to Drake's shirts. Like, this is the album cover. Let me enjoy my tea. Another reason why I liked it is you can see like the album cover itself. The inside of the dog is colored with that crayon. And they actually brought that vibe well to the shirt as to the t-shirt as well, the graphic. And I didn't point out, a lot of people use cheap blanks. You know, we go to concerts, we grab a lot of merch. It'd always be like cheap little blanks. His actually is Drake related. That's what it says inside, Drake related. 100% uh, cotton, machine wash, cold, tumble, low, dry. Do not bleach, do not dry clean. Hang dry, like I tell you guys every time. Made in the USA. It's a it's a nice material t-shirt, I'm not gonna lie to you. It does not feel like a cheap gilding or nothing like that, like one of those cheap blanks. It's a nice t-shirt. For $45 as well, I forgot to cover that. We only paid $45. All his t-shirts were $45. Did it not matter what graphic you picked, all merch was $45, which I think is a great price. There's people like St. John with the Christian Sex Club. His shirts are running for like 90 bucks sometimes on tour, 80. Hoodies are like 150. So it really depends. I thought 45 was a fair price for artists like Drake and this kind of quality as well because I'm used to a lot of cheaper quality guys. We have crazy merch. You know what's crazy? We went to that Favi concert and that might have been the worst merch I've ever grabbed in my life. I was smacked that night. I think we did a vlog as well. I'm not sure if we did a vlog, but if we did, I was smacked for the Favi. Smacked. And then I woke up the next day and looked at the merch like, nah, this nigga burn me, bro. And leave it up to a Brooklyn nigga. Leave it up to somebody from Brooklyn. How I get got from a nigga from Brooklyn, bro? Fabi out here selling paper thin t-shirts. Oh man, oh, I got my whole cabinet full of glitter. I had to hang that shit up. Like, we're gonna do the unboxing. We're gonna see how you guys feel. Maybe I'll feel different that day. I might have to get lit for that unboxing again before we do it. And listen to Weddy like four times. Cause last time I looked at it, I was like, you got me, but I'm still happy we brought this because I've never bought merch I don't like and ever talk shit. So usually the merch that we see on this channel stuff that I liked and I picked out. We never done the 50 either. I gotta do the 50 merch. I actually just thought about that right now. We never did the 50 merch. Gotta do the 50. But yeah, that Fabi sign out. We're gonna probably do that soon so I can get my jokes off. I also like how the print of the crayon looks on this t-shirt. Like they made it look dope. I'm not gonna lie to you. From the front to the dog being colored in to the back as well. And I have a white dog. You guys see my big ass golden doodle come out throughout the videos at time. You seen my big ass golden doodle. No, he don't got red eyes. No, he don't got red eyes. But for all my dogs, is Ja on my t-shirt right here. That's my dogs on my t-shirt. When people ask me for all my dogs, it's my dogs on here. Drake and my dogs, that's who it is. That's who I'm rocking with, no demonic shit. 
But let's go try this on, see what you guys think. $45 retail. One thing I almost forgot to let you guys know before we zoom up, try it on, and do all that. One thing I forgot to let you guys know. $45 was the retail for it, right? I think it was. We bought a whole bunch of shirts. I want to say I think it was $45. Someone sent me. It's all a blur merch. Dot com. So IAABmerch.com. I forgot exactly who, whoever you are, shout outs to you. But is the merch authentic? I don't know, I'm not gonna lie. I was supposed to ask that day as well, because they sent it to me that day. I was supposed to ask, show people at the merch, like, yo, this shit is real. Like, can I still keep copying if I wanted more on this on the app, on the website? But I never did, I forgot. I was smacked and I was just amazed about all the shirts and I wanted a whole bunch of shit. But this shirt right here is an online exclusive sold on here and they do have all the shirts that I saw in person that day. They have them all plus more, I'm not even gonna lie to you. There's a couple extras in here. So I'm like, is it real, is it not? I don't know. I try to scan all the way to the bottom to see like emails because they be breaking some time with some weird stuff. But nah, it says at 2023, Drake and 21 Savage, it's all a blur, uh, tour merchandise store official. So I'm like, there's no way that they would have, that they would have fakes on here, I think, with their content. Let's check their contact information. Yeah, like even the contact info at aabmerch.com for again buying so much merch, seeing these sites and stuff like that. Just seems like a real. It just seems like a real address. Sometimes you be seeing George at hotmail.com. You're like, what the hell does that got to do with Drake? No one. You see little flags like that. I know people that are gonna trust it and they're gonna buy from it. I don't see why I would think this is fake. I'm not gonna lie to you. And it's the real merch that day. Like they don't got no funny looking merch. It all seems like shit that I seen that came out on this tour. If anybody knows anything about this site, please let me know. I'll put a screenshot. But I'm like 95% sure that it's official merch also when you search up his merch is the first site that pops up which i'm sure that would have got a season assist a while ago if it was fake merch but the shirt that we unbox here for all my dogs official album t-shirt cover is 55 dollars. so they have it on this site for 55 and is it in stock yeah it's in stock right now 55 dollars. it goes up to 3x from a size small we got a size large i'm 170 i haven't scaled myself but i'm assuming i'm like 175 176 that was the last time I scaled myself. And this is a size large. I kind of like that oversized look t-shirt. I'm thinking I might rock this this weekend if I step outside. Like this is a this weekend t-shirt. I ain't even gonna hold. But we're gonna try it on before this weekend. We're actually gonna try it on today. So we'll see how this fits. Let me know down below any questions you have. If you're new to this channel, I'm gonna zoom up, show you guys the close up details. If anyone happens to buy anything from this site, I show all the tags, how the inside of the shirt should look. So if your shirt matches this one, you are good. Again, I am pretty, 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 pretty sure that it's all official merch on this site. There's a contact there as well. I'm not sure if that helps you feel better. There's a refund policy as well too. Like that's what I'm thinking. Oh no, nah, no there's not. No there's not. Due to high demand, no there's not. Unfortunately, returns, exchanges, and cancellations are not being accepted at this time due to high demand. Please feel free to contact if you have any problems with your merchandise that comes in. Thank you for your cooperation. I don't know, it just seems like a real site. Let me know what you guys think if you trust it, if you trust it or you copy anything. Try this on, subscribe to the channel. We're on that road to that 10,000 sub. Before we can get to 10,000, we gotta get to 5,000. I got suspended, so I couldn't upload for a week. That shit killed the algorithm. So if you wanna help a brother out, like the video, por favor, comment down below. Do you like the album? Is today October 6th, how do you feel? Or share your thoughts. People usually never like Drake's albums when they first come out. And then they come back three, three years later like, nah, that shit was a classic, low key, classic. Let me know down below what you think. <laughs> For all my dogs, you here for all my dogs though? You here for all my dogs? Come on, son. And this motherfucker.